Hello and welcome back to Magic the Gathering opening time. Uh, it's Gary Jacek. Um, I've lost part of a recording, um, so I'm just gonna go back through. I have a box with Angry Chandra on it. That's the other Angry Chandra. I'm just gonna show you the uncommons and rares we've seen, that we've gathered so far. I also gathered some mirrors, which is really nice. Uh, we have Dispense Justice, which is uh, a white uncommon, which is a holographic. Um, I'm just gonna quickly go through these. Lunalist, Siren, Burning Rage, Burning Vengeance, Bolt, Seradon, Naya, Charm. Seriously, what um, clan or tribe is Naya? I get it uh, in Palladium more colored, but is it actually like um, a color? Like, as in like a deck type? Naya? Because this symbol is before um, Dragon's Maze. No, no, no Dragon, um, like, Cards of Tarkir and stuff, isn't it? So, uh, Nih we have a lot of Nih Nibblers of the Year, by the way. Riddle Smith, which is interesting. A lot of stuff seems to be. I think this is Mirrodin, maybe? <coughs> uh, Dark Revenant, um, Zorish Charms. We've got a different charm this time. <laughs> a 6 2 with First Haste and Trample, guys. No, no. Uh, first Strike and Haste, even. Um, another stupid uh, two cost Golgari card. Assassin Strike, which is terrible for its cost. A Vessel of Endless Thrust, which is a basically stronger Mandalith. Um, and more of these nibbles the end. Halt order, which is a zero. No, it's, um, yeah. Count to target out of height spell injury. There's also a lot of stuff in Meridian, or at least one of these new mess sets, which seems to really hate artifacts. Ah, <coughs> uh, slice the twain. And, and, yeah, a rare mirror, which gives you two mana. That's two mana. Not colorless. Well, it is colorless, but it's like, it's not man of any color kind of mana. That's quite a lot already. Um, we're going through more. We have Rakdos Rage Mutt. Five, co five cost. Uh, Lifelink Haste 3-3. Three, three. Uncommon, not bad. It's elemental Um, we have a Hen Ireland. Uh, Pursuit of Flight, which is Is It? Which has um, it's a two cost enchantment or it gives it to a creature has plus two plus two, which is nice for a two cost, and for water gives uh, gives it sorry wet mana. Now that's a new thing I'm trialing wet mana. <laughs> um, gains flying until end of turn. Uh, drain pipe vermin. Uh, giant growth. Cross town courier. <coughs> uh, planes. Oh, oh, we can finally do it, guys. Planes. Swamp, swamp, forest. Swamp, 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 swamps. Oh. I'm, I'm sad now. I wanted to go on for longer. Also, some of these lands are Mirrodin lands, I think, yeah. <coughs> uh, Spiteful Shadows. When enchanted creatures don't damage, it deals damage damage to its controller. Interesting. Interesting if you can't, if you enchant this on a creature has indestructible, and then it's just use really cheap, cheap red spells which say deal damage to a creature. Kill your opponent very fast that way. Truth. <coughs> um. <coughs> undying evil. Target creature that gains undying until end of turn. Well, that's crazy. <coughs> and Liliana says, Is it true that evil, the evil that people Sorry, is it true the evil that people do follows them into death? Let's find out. <laughs> oh, no, there's two copies of that. Um, and then we have Erdwall, er, er, Erdwall Ripper. When you deal combat damage to a player, plus one, plus one, plus one counter on it, not bad. And there's two, three copies of that. We have Essence of Un... Fires of Undeath. Deals to the to target your player, three cost, flashback for six. Who's gonna play six mana to deal two damage to something? Nobody. Um, Fling, we've seen this in several sets, including Almond Cat, I think. Uh, N Near Half Stalker has Undying. Do not speak of the others. They're looking favorably upon my indulgences. Yeah. Uh, Rustic Wolves, which is a 4 cost 3 3. So, shit. Two of those. I guess wolves have a wolf tribal thing. Scorch the Fields! Destroy target land, deals one damage to each human creature. I am fire. I am death. <coughs> Thanks, Smaug. That's like six copies of that. 
Talons of Falcon Wreath, which is a flash enchantment, which has for two gets double fire breathing, I guess. Talon breathing, I guess. What's in Collins? No. Uh, Torch Fiend. It's a dead. Well, when you sacrifice a destroyed target champ, an artifact. Seriously, what the fuck is up with so many classes saying destroyed target artifact? Uh, Wreck with Madness, which is a 4 5 4 cost, which doesn't have a madness cost. Yeah. Target creature does damage to itself equal to its power. <laughs> Thumping face. <laughs> um, Cling Mists. Prevent all common action all its turn. If you have 5 or less life, tap all cre target attacking creatures over creatures and tap during the control step. And tap step. Nice. Uh, question of vines. That looks like a very scared bird. <laughs> and again, just for a target creature flying or just for a target artifact. Seriously, stop with the uh, anti artifact stuff. It's very mean. Think of the poor artifacts. Um, Dawn Rider Elk, which is a bear which can sacrifice itself for one to get a land onto the battlefield tower, which is nice. Good in, um, landfall, I guess. Favor of the words, which enchants it. And every time to a creature blocks you gain three life. Because we needed more ways to gain life. Uh, Terrace Worm, which has scavenge for seven. It's a five five for seven. Which means it's bad! Just saying. <laughs> and a swamp. This is a cool looking swamp, and there's two different swamps. I feel like this is like mirrored in besieged, or like I don't know. It, it's it's definitely something to do with Phyrexians and mirrored in. I think because it definitely looks like it looks like mirrored. What I would imagine mirrored in to be, but like infected as hell. What's the new like noon Phyrexia or something? Uh, uh, troll hide. Uh, ooh, we have a rare from we have an uncommon which I is French, and therefore I have no idea what it says. So, answer in a postcard, please. I guess this is a worm of some description. But what does it do? But what does it do? I don't know. Somebody answer me, please. And there's... Oh, wait. The next, very next card is the same card, but actually in English. So it is called Grave to the Worm, which is a six cost. With trample, 4-4. Four, four. When it enters the battlefield with... Sorry, it enters the battlefield with four plus one plus one counters on if a creature died this turn. So it is a six cost, which can be an 8-8. Eight, eight. Even as a f 6 cost 4-4 four, four Trampler, that is not bad. <coughs> also, you could just cast something for 2 if you're playing Growl. Kill something, then cast this. It's all about order of operations, guys, and I'm not just talking about math. And that is the sound of a very angry math teacher. I don't know. Uh, okay. Fuck. We have got... Oh my god, is another kitty. So we had zombie cat earlier, and this is a sanctuary cat, which is a 1-2 cat. For one, which... Play cats. Also, it's a cat. It's a, it's a cat, guys. I don't see a dog creature anywhere, do you? Not that I don't like dogs, I actually like dogs, I just like kittens, they're adorable, and they're memeable. Don't judge me, and please don't hurt me. Uh, we have an uncommon witch at Oak Street Innkeeper. Three cast, as long as it's not your turn, tap creatures you control. Hexproof. Hooray for elf having elf things. Uh, Drake Mangler, which is a three card in Golgari Colors, which is a three three. With haste, and it's a plant zombie. How do plants become zombies? You could have just called it a Drifid. Would have made more sense. But okay, sure. Let's go with that. Um, so it has, it's a 3 3 with haste. Uh, scavenge, 5 cast, exile this card from the very upper number, blah blah blah, yeah. And annihilating fire. And, <laughs> aerial predation. Oh, is it time? Yes, it is. Uh, island, mountain, island, island, mountain. Is it Gilgate? Had no click and say it because it's still a land. Also, it is stunned. Mountain, island, and R. Complimentary man, sir. Wait. This isn't Gilgeronica. 
It's a reprint? I thought it was an entire new card. No. I've been lied to. All certain. <clears throat> but okay. Um, it's also nice again, is it Gilgate? Which I believe is actually different artwork to the previous Is it Gilgate? Which is cool. Sorry, the newer Is it Gilgate just means the newer Is it Gilgate? Yeah. You know what I mean. <coughs> you know what I mean. Shut up. But we have a Golden Lotus Round, so we have another Gutter Snipe, which is amazing. Uh, we have Common Bond, Golgari Longlegs, Skullrend, um, Tristani's Judgment, Exile Tide Creature, then Populate. I picked one up literally the day. Uh, Santos Herald, Cobble Brute. <laughs> ah, just a bit of there. Uh, is it Charms? So that's a, what, three out of five Charms? So what does this one do? <clears throat> so this one's on like a, uh, I don't know, it's a locking device, like a rock fire. Or something. Um, choose one. Count target screen on creature spell. Control place two. Or deal to damage target creature. Or draw two cards and discard two cards. Interesting. Um, we have Golma's Warden. Uh, yeah. um, electricery. Sorry. Deals one damage to target creature you don't control for one. Or overload. Which basically makes it what? Um, Vol that flaming volley. Why would you pay three when flaming volleys? I mean, I know it was years ago, but why would you do that? <laughs> Times have changed, old man. Uh, we have another treasure find, and a mountain, and council, and frostburn weird, which is is it? And you give it plus one minus one to land a turn, so you can make it up to, I suppose, unless you have plus one plus one camera side. You can make it up to by itself a four one. Yeah, you could you could flip it essentially for three mana. But why would you do that? And then survey the wreckage, forecast, and you can destroy target land and put one one golden creature on the battlefield. Why? <laughs> this is another one of these. Why moment? It's like that one um, where you can destroy a creature for six mana and then also make you put that con card's controller to discard a card. But why? Why was why is that attached to this? I have another cross town courier, a uh, teleportal, which is an uncommon, which was also a and what are the artworks actually used in the set? I believe, just in general, like the advertisement for it. Uh, target creature control gets plus one, plus zero until the end of turn, and it's unblockable this turn, and you can overload it for five, and so everything becomes unblockable plus one. That's cool! Then we have a Phantom General, which is a four cost, which is a Spirit Soldier. Creature tokens you control get plus one, plus one. What deck do I know that plays creature tokens? I don't know! I don't know anyone who's building creature token decks. Uh, it's useless to me then. But not really! Because Salem doesn't play tokens. Uh, cyst, cyst Bearer, that just sounds disgusting. Three cost, and it looks like it's fucking. It looks like someone's trying to make, like, um, gummy bears on its back. It has, in fact. Oh god. Phyrexia strives to stimulate, stimulate natural life, but it can't resist improving on the design. Thanks, Phyrexia! Fuck you. Uh, we have Centaur Healer. And that's about three to game three life. It's a... Yeah. Uh, Skull Rend. Horn Caller's Chant, which puts... Oh, this is... Yeah. Eight cost. Ridiculous. Uh, Swift Justice. Get target creature gets plus one plus zero and has first break and lifelink. That's a lot for one mana if you're a drain pipe. Vermin, um, in Chronic Flooding. Swamp. Skeletal Grimace. Looks disgusting. Woodland Sleuth. Uh, Abundant Growth. Oh, that's... So that's like, um... We had a card like that in one of the most recent sets, which is this, but less mana, higher mana cost. Then as a land, a battlefield, draw a card, and land, add, exactly add one mana of any quality mana pool. So it turns a land... Ma, ma, it turns a land into a multicolored land. Nice. Uh, terrifying Presence. Uh, cool to Serve. Um, turn stuff into angels. Okay. Swift Justice. Cancel. 
uh, Golgari Guildgate, which is nice. <laughs> uh, forest. Oh, we have new Prov Guild Mage, which is Azorius. Target creature cast flying into another turn for Azorius. Will for three and Azorius detain target non-land permanent and opponent controls. Non-land permanent, not creature. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna arrest, I'm gonna arrest your artifacts. Fuck you. <coughs> uh, and we have Selesna Kyrie, which is an uncommon, <coughs> which adds Selesna colors. Or you can turn it into a three green and white wolf artifact green for another turn. A mark of unity when you want one, a fierce guardian when you need one. It was the, it was the artifact we needed, not the artifact, the artifact we, well, not the artifact we deserve. Um, fairy the imposter. And then the battlefield sacrifice unless you turn another creature you control to turn his hand. Tiny fairy. Um, destroy the evidence. Destroy target land. This control reveals card in the loving line. Two green land. Then put this card in the graveyard. Come here. Centaur's uh, Herald, Splatter Thug, uh, Peril of Shadow, Vassal Soul, Azorius, and Hybrid, Rakdos, Guildgate. I must have like one of every guild Guildgate at this point, I swear. Um, Axe Bane Guardian. You can add X. Wait, you can add X in any combination of colors to a mana pool, where X is the number of creatures the defender you control. Oh um, my god. That's bullshit. <laughs> Uh, downsize, things overload, you can, yeah. Um, blur, uh, cremate, exile card from the tag card, grab that and draw a card. That's actually pretty good for one cost. And we have a rare, which is, ha, uh, ha, ha, haven ghoul rule, rune binder. Four cost, human wizard, two, two. And for three, and tap it. Exile card from your graveyard, put a two, two black zombie creature token on the battlefield, then put a plus one, plus one counter on each zombie creature you control. Oh my god! Again, I still don't know what deck could possibly be using cards where you exile stuff to create tokens. I really don't know. Especially not involving zombies. Uh, forest, plains, plains, forest, plains, plains, forest, plains, off. Oh. And another guild mage. And another scholar and cancel plains, off. Oh. Uh, Sluiceway Scorpion. Huh? Scorpion! No one's gonna understand that joke. Tenement Crusher. Ireland. Plains. Oh. Swift Justice. Plains. Uh, Armory Guard. Ireland. Uh, Chronic Flooding. Uh, Search Warrant. Uh, Azorius Guildgate. <coughs> Azorius Arrestor. Hey, I like it. Arrest things. Grim roused about, roast about, roused about, found about. Ireland, Crystal Soul, another Guildgate, Plains. <coughs> we have an uncommon, which is Dark Revenant. When Dad put on top of the other's Ribery. Ribery? Ribery! Ribery? Uh, we have another Selesna Kiri. And a Tablet of the Guild, which is a really nice one. Uh, when it ends up a battlefield, choose two colors whenever you cast a ball. If it's one of the chosen colors, you gain one life each of the chosen colors it is. That's pretty good. I only play in my um my nickel bubbles commander deck because I just choose whichever two colours I have most of at the time. Being either black, blue, or blue, red, or whatever. Um A Sparrow Skywatch, which just detains things. Ethereal armor, which Enchanted creature has plus one plus one vision. Enchanted control has first strike. Oh my god, that's adorable! In that it's just so incredibly bullshit. Uh, cancel. And <laughs> when you needed to cancel your subscription to a magazine. <laughs> um. <laughs> uh, eyes in the skies creates blibs and populates. Chorus of might. You create a plus one plus one. You control. The creature you control, oh sorry, target creature gets plus one plus one. You control, get trampled. Uh, paralyzing grasp. Planes, oh. Uh, thrill kill assassin, which isn't an uncommon. There's a death touch with unleash. 
and not unleashing it because death touch. Just saying. It doesn't need to be any higher than a one mana cost. It doesn't even need to have a plus one plus one on it. It has death touch. <laughs> Ridiculous. Why does it have unleash? It has death touch. Do a uh, rat. Uh, courier annihilating fire. Rune wing is a boob. Uh, Diner charge. <coughs> Tiger Richard Dog is plus two plus zero in that turn. I'm going to avoid it. Uh, Essence backlash. Uh, dispel, which is instance. Um, <coughs> Giant growth. Creator's instinct. Inspiration. Um, Druid's deliverance, which I have one copy of in my um, deck anyway. Ethereal arm, another one. Usar Patrol, more like Hussy Patrol, which is a flash 2 4 Vigilance, which doesn't have a turn, really. Common Bond. Uh, another tablet of Regales, holy crud. <laughs> uh, Perilous Shadow, Splatter Thug, Traitorous Instinct, uh, Reap the Sea Graph again, Centrous Herald again, Destroy the Evidence, uh, Codex Shredder, which is an uncommon, which is one cost. Tug Creature puts the top card of his library into the graveyard. All for five, you sacrifice return Tug Creature. Card from your graveyard to your hand. Not bad. And something I did actually run in a version of my is in my Demir deck as well. In fact, I have a feeling that was reprinted. Uh, another uncommon we have an is it key rune, which is interesting. I like the key runes. Uh, and yeah, wet or hot man material mana pool. And for two until end of turn. It becomes a 2-1 red and blue elemental artifact of creature. Whenever when it, it deals damage, damage to a player, you may just draw a card, and if you do, discard a card. And another one, which is another doggo. And a planes. And another bellows lizard. Armory guard. Uh, aerial predation. Or guard. Yep. Uh, search warrant. Pegasus. Judge's Family, which is an uncommon in um, one cost Azorius uh, hybrid. It's a burb, if you didn't guess. Uh, sacrifice to counter tug instant or sorcery spell, unless his control pays Juan, which sometimes is useful. Just saying. Especially if you're playing against doors off, it's one less time they can extort you. Technically. And then there's, there's a rest, which <coughs> basically constantly detains something. Forever. Um. Apple Wound, Common Bond, uh, Corsada Guild Mage, which is the Guild Mage for Golgari, uh, for 2, 2, 2, it's a bear, uh, or t uh, so for 3, target creature in Golgari, uh, gets minus plus 1, plus 1 turn end of turn, and gains Intimidate also. Uh, for 4, sacrifice an on-target creature, put X, 1, 1, screens, sacrifice a creature, don't go back for where X is that sacrifice to your creature's toughness. Interesting, that might also go on the stupid target spam deck, because... I can pump something in the graveyard so I can eternalize it or embalm it later. Or you can get tokens because when he dies. So like that. And a crit more saplings. And just Oh, crit four saplings, as if to create eight because they're into possession. Fuck you. Uh rubble back rhino. It has hex proof, it's a three four. Um Muslim skin, greatly salvage. <coughs> uh batter horn. Uh, Trestle Troil, Trestle Troll, uh, Electromancer, Common Bomb. We have an uncommon which is Z Z Z Zanikev Locust. It's a 6 cost flying through 3 with flying and scavenge for 4. Okay. <coughs> um, Forest, oh. Swift Justice, Horn Callers Chant, which is ridiculous. Um, Bellows Lizard. Lang legs, lang legs, skung rail, skung, skung rand, uh, bird, pearl of shadow, shrosonic judgment, uh, shlush sh 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 scorpion, uh, thought flare, which is an uncommon, five cost, draw four cards and discard two. Whoa. If this is thinking, I don't know what I was doing before. <laughs> I don't know what I was doing before either. Another gutter snipe. Oh, shrosonic judgment, uh, dr dead reveler. I guess that's fair. Um, yeah. Uh, Beaches on Leash, which is three. Uh, Tower Drag, Azorius Guildgate, 
uh, Canister's Trick, Axe Bane Guardian, uh, Keening Apparition, you can sacrifice it to destroy target enchantment. Sure. Uh, Vishander, Lacketeer, Sewer, Shambler, just scavenge and, and swamp and swamp walk. Uh, Drudge Beetle, which is a sick. So it's if one cost. So hang on a minute. So it's a two cost. Okay. Two two. Which its scavenge cost is six. What the f. What the fudge? Why would you pay six to put two plus one plus ones on something? Don't make any sense. When you consider that the card that was the previous card is three to put two plus one plus ones on it. In black. Why the fuck does this cost six to scavenge? What? <laughs> uh, race call sphere, which is an uncommon. Uh, enchant land, target creature gains haste another turn if you tap that land. Not bad. Uh, the Soul Soul, Mutant, Ireland, um, Course is a Chord, put a 3-3 center on the dragon land, you'll then populate. Not bad. Uh, Dun Charge, Terrace Worm, <coughs> 7 cost with Scavenge, uh, Hunter of the Wolf Pack, 4 of the Gout, which is an uncommon, 5 cost, can I target spell, you gain 5 life. My ruling is up, it's final. Order is upheld. Justice is done. Um, burden of guilt, you can tap things, and there's three copies of that there. Break of day, two cards, creatures you control get plus one plus one on turn. If you have five or less life, they will send a strike wall. And the next turn. Uh, there was three cards of this. Bar the door, ho hold the door. Creature you control get plus zero plus four to the end of turn. Um, Elgard uh, in Inquisitor. It's a four-cost life linker. When it dies, put a one-one wide spirit creature with long on the outfield. Okay. Um, and then we have Gavoni Iron Right, which is uncommon. Take for as long as you have five or less life. Other creatures can't. Yeah, we've seen those before. Uh, and we have a Nibblest of the Mist, a Nibblest of the Mist, a Nibblest of the Mist, another Nibblest of the Urn. Uh, and then Ireland. I'm guessing this person must have built like a spirit deck at some point. Guys, there's a lot of spirits over here. Nimbus of the Mist, another one, another one. Dead Reveler, Unanalytic Fire, Caldus Rhoda, Monitor, four cost. And this one is Scavenge for seven, despite it being a three through it. Who would pay seven to put three plus one plus one counters on anything? Nobody! <coughs> another Trust on his Judgment, and finally, an Uncommon, which is Slitherhead. Which is a plant zombie, <coughs> which has scavenge for zero. And that's pretty much all it does. It's also high root, so I guess it's a free plus one plus one if you mill it. Technically. Also, it's a one one for one. It's not bad. It's a hybrid, so it's you the cows. It's not bad. Um, but this, guys, is the pile of pretty much all. The uncommons and the rares from that. No mythics, unlike the other box, but that's a lot of uncommons and rares. <coughs> Mostly uncommons, but I ain't complain. I got some good shit out of it. <coughs> anyway, guys, this has been Kenny Jack Hope you guys enjoyed this video here. Don't forget to leave a like if you did. This is Kenny Jack signing off. I am very tired. Bye bye for now. <coughs>